have two feet in when he got the takedown. So they're just going to reset to the middle, but it's still an impressive showing by Chris here. They reset to the middle, take a little bit. Both hands are around each other's heads. Looks like they're headbutting like two bulls right now. Circling around. Both of them are in head headlocks, dead even right now. They're going to hold for a moment. So when you're in neutral like this, really what you're looking for is who's going to take the first shot, right? And now the mentality here is if he takes a shot, you're going to score, and if you take a shot, you're going to score. Now they're broken out of it, back in a headlock. Here's some movement. Chris goes down near the leg, takes it, gets the advantage on top, takes him down. It's two points here for Chris. The reason he was able to get that takedown, he went in with speed, he got a good setup, and he got around, pivoted the leg. Very well executed by Chris. Smith is trying to bring him outside the mat. Legend player is on the very edge right now. Looks like Chris is going to get back points. Oh, the period cuts out just short. So the period ends, and Mount Vista leaves. Now they're in a headlock. What Chris is doing right now is he's taking fake shots to try to get him off his balance. Smith brings him to the ground. Legend player is on top. Smith breaks out of it. Now he's on top. That's an extra two points. Now Smith tries to bring him down. Legend player gets the advantage. Now he's on top. Still hasn't gotten the two points yet. He has to get control of his own leg before he can officially score. So Chris will have a fighting chance to get back behind him right here. Smith trying to get out of it. Legend player trying to get the two points. And he is going to get the two here. And he gets the two points, and now it's five. First period, it's now going to be uh, the legend wrestler's choice what position he wants to take, and it looks like he chose bottom. Yeah, he did choose bottom. And this is the point in a wrestling match where you can see how heavy Chris is breathing. Both wrestlers are very tired. And what it really comes down to is who has the most mental grit and stamina and who can win the match. Well, hopefully Chris has... Hooks around the ankle. That's called a stubby ride. It's useful for breaking people down. And Chris flings him to the ground. Chris back on top. Now moves like that Matt return right there are really just a showing of physical strength and as well as technique. Forty seven seconds left in the period. Or until the end of the end of the match, that is. Smith back on top again. Smith's hands are around the legend player's head. Legend player lifting up. Brings down Smith again. Smith back on top, 25 seconds to go. Both players are on top. Looks like Smith has him in a headlock and he's gonna fling him down to the ground. Now, if Legend gets an escape and a takedown here, that would tie at 5-5, and then we would see overtime. So all Chris needs to do is make sure that in these last 17 seconds of the match that his opponent isn't able to get up and get a takedown. Smith, Smith wrestles the Legend player to the ground. He's on top, has him in a chokehold. Final 10 seconds. Smith lifting up. He's hanging on for dear life right now. And that will be the end of the one. Back at neutral, Legend is back on top. Comrade looks at more of a steady grip this time. Legend back on top, Comrade flips himself on top of Legend. It's the reversal. Needs to sink back into him to get him back onto his back. So Vista gets two points, they lead 4-2. Conrad has him by the neck. Legend flips out of it for only a moment. Conrad has a strong grip on top. Legend, play, legend player tries lifting his leg up, is not able to. He's working towards the head. He's got him on his back now. He's got back points. Could get a pin here. There's the pin. And that's a pin for Conrad. 
never gave up. He stayed mentally tough throughout all of it. And as you can see, even though he did not score first, he still ended up winning the match by pitting him while the score was going to. So, Legend tries to go down, is not able to. Now Legend's on the ground, and Ryan is on top. Ryan falls down, Legend is able to get control. Ryan crawling away, and they lead 4-0. Blake falls to the ground, still on top. Now Blake gets him by his legs. He flicks him up into the ground, into the sky. Now he's back on top. Legend player crawling away, Vista leads 2-0. Blake on top, by the neck, brings him down to the ground, looking for the pin. Referees right there, looking down at Blake and the legend player, 15 seconds to go. He's gonna need to get this one fairly quick. Legend player scrambling away, trying to get out of it. Blake on top, has him by the neck, has him by the leg. Legend just barely avoiding the pin. And they pull the pin at the very end. Blake Ugly with the pin. Brings him back over. Legend player is on the ground. Long's shoulders on top of his head. Legend tries to break free. Long has him. Trying to go for the pin. And they call the pin for Long. That's another win for Mountain Vista. It's a square on his back. The legend opponent simply isn't able to bridge out of it as he has both shoulder blades directly onto the mat. Nowhere for him to really go. And that's an excellent win by Brennan Long. He's not phased at all by what happened in the first period, just coming right out and taking the blow for this. Just giving away a free point to Joe Chaplin there because he wanted to get the mountain turn. Legend player's confidence isn't making up for something, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Joe moving towards the edge of the mat. Legend player trying to break free. Joe's ankles have his head. And Joe gets flung out of the mat. Well, that That's will be one be point for Vista. For stalling. Ref is talking to the legend wrestler. Colin Mooney up on top. Media start to the match and he gets behind. Moving around. Mooney is on top. He's going to suck him back down. And he is going to get back points here. Legend player trying to get up and he gets dropped back down to the ground. And what he's doing here is he's bridging off of his back and really trying to escape, but he's not going to be able to as Colin gets the pin here in the first period with 50 seconds left. It's a very quick pin for Colin. And uh, Vista leads 55 by the neck. Gets that headlock here. Looking to get to the leg. Not giving up on his position. And he takes a shot. Gets his Aiden hips inside. Has him by the leg. He's got the single leg here. Gonna Brings him down, down to the to ground. The gets him by the waist. So what he did there, he grabbed that leg, he elevated it, and once he had him balanced on his other leg, he took that leg out from under him and brought him down to the mat. Aiden is on top. Brings the legend player down on the ground. Legend player trying to get away like a dead fish who's been pulled out of water. Coaches calling for the pin. Aiden has him by the leg. Crawling away. Looks like he's got a strong hand on him. And he's got this plenty of time to pin. look for this pin here. It's out. It's good. And he's just going to let him reset and get more back points here. They're going to give Aiden three points. He leads 7-0. to zero. One minute to go in the second period. Aiden has him. Gets a different angle on him. And the crowd here is energized in the Mountain Vista gym. Referee pointing at Aiden for a second. Aiden has the legend player by the neck. Jumps up and over him. Switches sides. Pushing out of the ring. He's not allowing him to bridge. He's sucking his and head up. And there's so the pin! Mountain Vista gets it to Aiden 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 right. And they end the night 61 to 15 and 12 of those 15 points for Legend.